Hello, this is Mike, nostressmike.com. Uh, I'm in Mexico City, and here I just wanted to kind of show you a little bit. See, there's uh, people walking the dogs, and there's sometimes there's places like this where the the uh, the sidewalk's not right, but in general, uh, it's been really nice. Um, I'm, I'm shocked uh, that there was one thing, there's a lot of malls, a lot of malls. And I've heard uh, that there's uh, the, some of the uh, biggest malls in uh, Central America, or Latin America, is uh, in Mexico City. Uh, I've gone to some of the markets. I don't like going around with a video uh, and video on all these places that I go to, uh, especially some of these markets. I, I really, in, I really personally enjoy um, uh, the markets that are like, uh, uh, what, what do you call it? Uh, flea markets. I like, you see, uh, look at all the taxi cabs. There's a lot of taxi cabs. Um, they have, the taxis have meters in them. So it's not like you got to negotiate a, a deal with the, the driver. So that helps a lot. Uh, but like I say, uh, when, you're, when you go to some of these flea markets, or markets, uh, like I say, especially as a gringo, taking the pictures and stuff like that, um, it's not really real good so you have to really watch out on kind of stuff especially on my kind of videos because I'm, I'm I'm talking about things I'm showing you all kinds of things and uh, uh, I, a lot of things you're gonna see in the videos that I don't talk about because I'm not sure what's interest you that's why you're gonna see it in comments somebody will see something in the video and comment about it and uh, but uh, so that's why I don't take the videos on there. And like, cause sometimes they got some really cool stuff. And I don't know if it's legal or not. So uh, that's why I don't really want to uh, put anybody in any kind of a difficult situation. And, uh, but anyway, now uh, I, just, I just left uh, the house. And uh, I'm going to go uh, eat some breakfast. Uh, the the women that I'm living with. Uh, this is the uh, thanks uh, New Year New Year, Christmas Eve, and so they're uh, one one took off and uh, uh, with family, and the other ones uh, took off to go to work. And uh, I told them, "Well, just go right ahead. It's no problem. I, I can get around. It's no big deal." Uh, Good. You see the guy using a pressure cleaner? I don't know if you can see it. Probably can't see it. But anyway, um, it's now I understand different parts of the city has got different kinds of things. This is one of the better parts of the city. It's not, uh, you know, one of the best. It's not like that. Uh, I forgot what the rent was. But I think I've said it in another video, but it, it's kind of expensive. And they said it was the cheapest. But uh, I'm about uh, four blocks, uh, we're right in the middle, about four blocks in every, every direction, you can find uh, uh, markets uh, uh, in the way of uh, uh, restaurants, stores, and this type of stuff. And that's what what I'm doing now. I'm looking to see about getting something to eat. And uh, you've got like these kind of places here. And uh, so, but yeah, I don't know what all this stuff is. And I've got a thing where I eat in a place where a lot of people are. And what I do is I look at what they what they're eating, and then I see something that I 
it's going to be good for me, and then I point to it, and, and uh, that's that's how I order it. So, but uh, now I say now we're coming uh, to the roundabout here, and uh, I will be stopping over here. We'll be stopping. I guess you can see it over there. Bunch of bread. All kinds of bread. Uh, on my way back to the house, I'll be stopping to get, get some bread. And, uh, but anyway, you can see there's a, we're at the roundabout now. This is where the people are. And you can see the street that, that I'm down on doesn't have that much traffic. You see there is traffic. We are kind of off the beaten path. So, okay. it's really nice. And I say, wow, I can smell the bread and it smells really good too. But anyway, we're going to, uh, I, I might even pick up a cigar. They got a cigar shop over here also. So, I might even go over there. But, uh, 7 Eleven, 7 Eleven. Go over here. Okay. I'm gonna go see what happens. Uh, here's a pharmacy. Uh, it, I'll tell you, the people in uh, Mexico are starting to be about the same as the United States in the way of going after the uh, uh, medicine. They take a lot of medicine. But I say the people I'm with are natural healers. So there's still a market um, for natural healing. But uh, definitely the, the pharmaceuticals are getting their foothold here in this place. But, but anyway, we're going to. I'm gonna go see if I can get something to eat. And it's gonna be, oh, let's go over here and look and see what they're doing over here. But, this is where we buy our wine here. Uh, the healers do a lot of wine. Ooh, maybe I'll be eating off the street. I'm gonna take a look. But, uh, it smells good. You see all the people. These are all reasons why I would eat in a place like that. So we're gonna. I'm gonna go. I'm really looking for a restaurant, sit-down place. So we'll try that. Boy, that was good. It wasn't on camera. And if I was in a little more hurry, I'd probably be eating off the street there. But I know there's some restaurants down here, and also the cigar shop. So, you see, there I got the street people cleaning up the street. So Mexico, they really do. Mexico City, they really do. Uh, clean the place up. It's nothing like I never wanted to come. I got here one time by accident when I was driving and it was on a Sunday. Oh, man, not much traffic, but there was a lot of traffic, especially, you know, for me it was, but it was a Sunday, so there wasn't that much. It took me hours to get out after I got here. Now this is going to be a little different here. So that's why I had the opportunity they invited me to come stay with them, and so then that's when I, I came. I, I'll be leaving here in a couple of days, but I've been here about two weeks. So that gives me a taste. Enough, and I told them I won't be back. <laughs> Mexico City is just like a big city. Don't want to get mixed up in the big city stuff. But, uh, wow. But it is. Let's see. It is pretty. It is really pretty. 
Also, I found out it's the the same altitude as uh, uh, Guatemala, where I was staying in Guatemala. So one thing you've got to be prepared for if you come to Mexico City, you're going to have some altitude sickness. And uh, but, but anyway, just want to let you know. This is Mike, no stress Mike, not calm. I want to go get me a cigar.